Let's be honest, at this point we're just kind of used to getting disappointed inside of Vanguard Zombies, but the question still remains, where is the ray gun in Vanguard Zombies? Vanguard Zombies is the very first time that the ray gun, the ray gun, has not been inside of Vanguard Zombies or any Zombies mode, for that matter, since World at War. In fact, it is the first time ever that a Treyarch Zombies game does not have the ray gun inside of it, or at least some sort of variation. But why is that? There could be a couple of different explanations. Obviously one of them is, I mean, this game doesn't even have a pause feature, so maybe they plan on adding the ray gun and it just hasn't been put in the game. Maybe there were some problems with it that were glitching out the game similar to something like the pause feature. Knowing Call of Duty right now, they're probably going to be like, hey, we're adding this brand new wonder weapon to the game. It's going to be super sick, and it's just going to be the ray gun. Like, if you had told me that the ray gun wasn't going to be in the game, but neither was the traditional pack-a-punch, the traditional box, the traditional monkey bomb, any of that sort of stuff, I would have been like, okay, I kind of get it. It's a sledgehammer game, Treyarch's helping out making the zombies, so on and so forth, but that's not the way it's working, because the traditional monkey bomb, the pack-a-punch, the mystery box, they are all in this game. So why would the ray gun not be in this game? I think one of the first times that we didn't have the ray gun on a map since sometime early on in Zombies Life Cycle was actually Firebase Z. But in that map, we technically also got the Ray K. So, I mean, give or take, it was very similar to the ray gun. But we have absolutely nothing like that inside of Vanguard Zombies. There's no wonder weapon. Really, the closest thing we have to a wonder weapon is the shotguns. That's about as good as it gets. But it wouldn't make sense for them to not add the ray gun, and I'd be okay if they tweaked it a little bit. I would be totally okay if they tweaked the ray gun so that instead of just being the traditional ray gun, maybe it was more magic related. Maybe it was more kind of on the terms that we have with something like the runes in the game or finding a way to make it so some sort of demon or being from the dark ether has a way to give us some sort of weapon like the ray gun. I get it. I get maybe Porter just isn't in this universe for some reason. Maybe, you know, Porter's ray gun can't be in this universe without Porter. Maybe Porter is on the toilet or something. I don't I don't know. I I, I wish I could tell you why the ray gun isn't inside of it, but is Vanguard's secret reason the ray gun isn't in it just because it would glitch out the game or because they honestly don't care? Like that's a real question. Is the ray gun not inside of Vanguard Zombies simply because Call of Duty and Sledgehammer and even Treyarch for that matter do not care? I don't think so. Like look, I get it. Maybe Treyarch doesn't want to put something into this game and put their all into Vanguard Zombies, which is pretty clear by the way, because it's not their main game. But with zombies not coming to Call of Duty next year with Modern Warfare 2, really, really, we need Vanguard Zombies to at least give us some semblance of continuity and consistency over the next two years, because after this, we're not getting a zombies mode until 2023. Honestly, if I'm being completely honest with how I think this is gonna go, I think that they are going to add the ray gun in a later season, some sort of them calling this a new feature a new wonder weapon out of the game, just like how the pause feature is a brand new feature and that's DLC content, just like how score streaks are basically DLC content inside of this game, just like how pack-a-punch camos are going to be DLC features added to the game later on in its life cycle. That is my number one explanation for what is going to be happening. The secret reason that the ray gun has not been added into the game is simply because they are going to be using it as some sort of content filler later on in the seasons. That is my guess. If I if, if I had to bet on it, if I had to bet my life on it, that is what I would say was going to happen. Now, as we prepare for the brand new Christmas event inside of Vanguard Zombies, today the festive fervor event will be coming out. I'm interested to see what you guys think about the future DLC for this mode. Let me know in the comments down below what you're thinking. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you soon. I wanna give a big shout out to all the channel members over on the channel and an extra special shout out to all of the Zombie Rigtoff members, starting off with hashtag best mod, strict archer, the quippest man in the southern hemisphere, commander underscore quip, my guy Ben the Bulldozer, and the man the myth the legend, Tiz Brandon, ZR.